I think with this song we probably started with the piano first, uh, which is, is now I was going to I came up with that piano part, but I didn't actually think I could play it well enough. So I actually got a session musician called Andy Wallace to play it, who I thought had a better feel than me. So one of the lessons you could maybe take from that is don't always think that you're the best person for the job on one of your songs. You might want to find someone who can play the piano or the guitar or the bass or whatever it is better than you. Um, I would always stand aside if someone can improve a song. I, I won't get put myself in the way just because I came up with that part. The drums are going to sound a bit like they sound very 90s now. They remind me of Soul to Soul, a song called Back to Life. They're very similar. I don't know if we deliberately tried to make it like Back to Life. I can't remember. I don't think, I don't think we did. But they do have that very 90s sort of swingy sound. But it works well. If you hear that with the piano, they work really well together. Put the piano in. And those drums and that piano is the basis of feel, really. And then we probably added the bass. The bass is very sustained. Very simple, the bass doesn't get in the way. It's just laying down the roots. And then guitars. Let's have a listen to the guitars. So, this is the solo section, the slide guitar. That's actually, I think there's maybe three guitars all playing the same thing. And that's why it sounds a bit out of tune, wide. Because this is actually. This is actually quite an important point. Um, you don't necessarily always want to have everything in tune. Um, one of the problems with modern technology and modern record making, everyone's obsessed with everything being in tune. There's obviously you can tune vocals, you can tune bass, you can tune anything now. And you can put everything in time as well. Um, but sometimes you don't want everything in time and you don't want everything in tune because Things that are wide, as I would describe, meaning wide, meaning that it's not tightly in tune. It's sort of, it's it's a bit. You could describe it as off, but that gives it a lot of character, and I think makes it more memorable. <laughs> 